Here we are for another steak unboxing on Going Carnivore in Thailand. Is noise fighting the box and the box is winning currently. Got your scale out. This is an order of 16 two inch thick ribeyes. Bring it up here and give a close up right in front of the camera. That's a good looking steak. And it weighs how much? 32, 72. Uh uh. You got the wrong. We have the. Okay, 32.16 ounces, just right like that. 32.26 ounces. So that's a two pound steak. So what we'll end up doing probably is we'll end up sous vide that as one steak but then we'll cut it in half when we, I mean, that's enough for two, two meals each. And how much is that one? 31.01. 31.01. So these are figuring out to be about two pound ribeyes. So we'll end up getting two sittings or two people out of one of these. Look at that beautiful fat on there. 29.05 looking good. Give it a close up. Wow, looks great. 34.83. Another more than two pound steak. Boy, they really treat us good. Like I said, one of these steaks is a meal for two. 39.01. 39. 29.01. That's better. Oh, ho, ho. looking good. Wow. I am getting hungry just looking at that. 36.08. Wow, so big. 36. Holy cow. <laughs> no, no pun intended. Holy cow. 33.31. 33.31. And how much did this whole box cost us? Uh, about 6,000 baht. So about 150 bucks or so. 6,000 baht, roughly. Uh, no, not really. Um, local about 200 baht. 200 less. Yeah. 31.45. 31.45. And there's 16 in that box? Yes. Wow. Yeah, you get, that's only half the box so far. You got eight more? Give us a close up of that one. Twenty two point 
22.93. Let's get a close up of it. Close up. People, people like to look at the fat content. There's a lot of fat there. And that helps you lose weight, eating that fat. Twenty-five point zero two. The reason we get them so thick is we want to be able to sous vide them to medium rare, but when we sear them, we don't want them to get medium. Twenty-five point sixty-three. Twenty-three point eighty-four. Wow, very good looking. I feel like Cooper's tie adventure here. Everything looks good. Twenty-six point thirty-four. Twenty-six point thirty-four. So these bottom stakes are a little smaller. They're like a pound and a half ones, which is good because then we can select whether we're in the mood to take a big one and split. Wow. Close up of that bad boy. Had a lot of meat there. Thank you, Cal, for giving your life for our carnivore adventure. Thirty point eighty. Thirty point eighteen. Eighty. Thirty point eight. Ah, oh boy. And this is about $150 worth of meat. 38.44 ounces. 28. Oh, baby. Looking good. Wow. Now, take the box down. And if you want... You could, you could, I want to swivel this around and show that we just got this brand new stand-up freezer. Why don't you show them what the inside of that freezer looks like, Noy? Wow, that's, that's like one drawer. You'll be lucky. I don't think that'll fit in a drawer. Five steaks in one drawer? Does a drawer open? Does a drawer come out? Looks like you get three, maybe four more in there in one drawer. Wow. By the way, this little refrigerator here was 
about 300, or a freezer, was about 350 US dollars. Round numbers. So how many did you get in that drawer? Nine. You got nine stick. Nope, that won't fit, honey. That will not fit, honey. That's okay. Nine in one drawer, that's good. Wow. And a lot of them are two pound steaks. This takes, this freezer will take a lot of workload and space away from the space we were using on our big refrigerator freezer. And if you notice, as I swivel over right here and I zoom in, looks like we've got three steaks in the sous vide right now. Uh, normal, those, those will get like 28, 32 hours in the sous vide. I think you're better off using the, the drawers before you use the top, but that's okay. But good enough for me. Well, that was our unboxing for today. Now we got some extra room that we'll take start taking things out of the refrigerator. And uh, these steaks that we're sous vide here, when they're done, they will end up going to the freezer over here, the big freezer. We will refreeze them, and as we want to eat them. We'll take them straight from the freezer, put them in the skillet with some butter, and sear up the outside of them. And they are delicious, or as Noy say, a Roy Mock. Thanks for watching. That's all, folks.